from big trucks to small cars and a new concern for drivers. A report from the Influential Safety Group, the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, shows that half of the cars tested performed poorly in new crash tests. Hampton Pearson takes a look at which small cars scored well and the ones that didn't. The collision tests for 12 small cars were designed to simulate crashing into a utility pole or a tree at 40 miles per hour on the side of the vehicle. When the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety evaluated the results, only six of the 12 cars performed well. Two Honda Civic models got the Insurance Institute top rating of good. The Dodge Dart, Ford Focus, Hyundai Elantra and the 2014 Scion got an acceptable rating. But popular models like the Chevrolet Sonic, the Volkswagen Beetle and Chevrolet Cruze were judged marginal, while the Nissan Sentra and two Kia models were rated poor. This particular crash is a big challenge for the vehicle structure. Those vehicles that did poorly, we saw a collapse of the occupant compartment where people sit in a car. Those cars um, that are performing better, um, the occupant compartment held up. The results are important because the small car market is one of the fastest growing. Americans have bought 1.8 million new small cars this year, a 12% boost from a year ago. The Insurance Industry Research Group says new cars have gotten safer in recent years, but these tests are designed to raise the bar and lower the estimated 9,000 fatalities per year associated with front wheel accidents. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Hampton Pearson in Washington.